Hi folks, in this particular video I am going to show you how we convert certain video formats which are not recognized by some tools, say for example Lightworks. So Lightworks is a typical example, uh, has some problems with exporting some formats like a MKV file. So I am going to create a test uh, project with the mixed rate in uh, Lightworks. So once I create, uh, I would uh, go to this local files. You can see MKV files are not really detected by uh, Lightworks. So what I'm going to do now is go to my explorer and uh, I will pick up a file which is MKV. I have a file called as uh, intro animation which is uh, uh, MKV supported so I'm gonna just drag and drop it so as you can see it's not able to import so it's saying that it's unable to import that particular MKV video so this is just an example so we may come across situations where we have troubles in importing MKV file fold file formats so what I have is a tool called as EaseFab Video Converter. It's very simple. You have to just click on import and then uh, go to the file which is MKV and as you can see it's imported already. Now go and click convert and it's a free tile just for demonstration and here it go it starts converting instantaneously and it's just an 8 second video and you see we already have the video here converted and you can see it's already mp4 and uh, yeah I'm gonna just play it now well it does not deteriorate uh, the quality of the video from what I had earlier so here it is just have this tool no hassles just import the file and it converts it's very simple and apart from all this we have certain other features that go along with the is fab there is a video editing tool as well which allows you to crop trim and a lot of other stuff but this is not a high-end editing tool so I would not recommend this tool when you have tools like Lightworks and Adobe Premiere and other tools it's not really recommended to use this but it's just an add-on go to the settings uh, nothing much here because it's a very simple tool it allows you to choose your updates and it also allows you to Go ahead and choose uh, NVIDIA GPU acceleration. If your GPU is powerful enough, it will use the GPU acceleration. So that's about the tool. Main usage of this tool is regarding conversion. So I hope this will help. So thank you.